Hey girls, it's Miss Sarah here again for another Smart Girls lesson. Um, pardon any background noises. My friends and I are having some ice cream. You can't really see. There you go. Some vanilla. My friend Erin's melting some peanut butter to put on top. Um, that's adulthood. You get to eat ice cream whenever you want. It's the best part. Um, but this week we are going to be talking about role models. So... First, I want you guys to think about what you think, um, what you think a role model is. What do you think the definition of a role model is? Um, kind of think of what your opinion is of it, and I will tell you that a role model is someone that you admire. Um, a role model is someone that exhibits qualities that you value. Um, and that you aspire to cultivate in yourself. Basically meaning um, there are things about that person that you really like, some qualities in that person that you really like that makes them, qualifies them as a good person, and so those are qualities that you want to take on yourself. Um, role models can help us become the people that we want to be. They serve as living examples for us and can help us define and refine what matters to us most. So, um, you know, celebrity role models can inspire us to be great athletes, actors, or rock stars, um, but they are more difficult to emulate effectively, uh, just because these are people that, um, you know, you see on TV, you see in movies, whatever, you hear their music, um, you see in interviews, um, but that's not people that you really come into contact with. Um, we only get to see part of who we are or who they are as opposed to um, who they are as a whole person. Um, and, you know, they're people too. So they have their own struggles like we do. Um, so I want you to think um, about some important qualities that are in a role model. Um, do you think that it is important for a role model... Thank you. Do you think it is important for a role model to uh, be kind? Is it important for them to be generous, um, strong, intelligent, um, driven, uh, compassionate, selfless? What are some qualities that you think are important for role models to have um, just for you or even just for people in general? Um, think about, you know, uh, maybe some of the role models you have and think about um, the qualities that they have that stand out to you that you so desperately um, want to emulate yourself in your own life. Um, and then I want to know even who your role models are. I want you to think about who um, your role models are. Um, like celebrities. Do you have celebrity role models? Um, I know I do. I have celebrity role models, but then I also have role models who are people that I know personally. Um, and I'll include that um, in the video. You'll see, you know, um, some of the celebrity role models that I have are, um, I love Zoe Deschanel. Um, I think she's an actress who um, is a great champion for people who, um, I think it's very obvious in her advocacy work for others, uh, that she has a really big heart, um, and I think she's a really talented actress, so, like, she's a role model for me, um, but then I think, like, the biggest role model that I have would be my mother, um, you know, she, um, was a nurse for all her life, um, and now, uh, works in a nursing program at a college, but, um, she worked very, very hard to, provide everything that um, my family and I needed uh, and some of what we wanted um, and is just a fantastic mother um, and a great daughter and um, sister-in-law like it's she's just an awesome role model uh, my mom is literally superwoman um, so that's those are my role models um, so I want to hear from you all who are some role models you have give me uh, some, like I said, I want to know some of your celebrity role models, um, and then I want to know, like, if you have family, um, or friends, or your club staff, um, you know, you have, 
great staff at uh, at your site. Uh, whether you are in Harlan or you're in Barberville, um, you have wonderful staff to choose from. Uh, so let us know um, in the comments. And um, my, I guess, challenge for you this week is um, reach out to um, one of your local role models. Uh, so whether that be somebody in your family, um, like I said, a friend's, um, maybe your friend's mom or a teacher, um, but reach out to them um, either on social media, write them a letter um, and get it to them, but reach out to them and make sure that they know um, how much they mean to you. Um, and thank them for being the person that they are because clearly if they are your role model, um, they're a good person. Um, and I think um, right now, especially with everything going on, everybody needs a little bit of, um, of positivity. Um, so be sure to reach out to them. Um, thank them for being who they are and um, for being the role model that they are to you. Tell them why. Tell them what qualities they have that... Um, what qualities they possess that um, that you love and that stick out to you. Um, and then sit down and think about, you know, um, am I a role model to others? Because that's the neat thing is, you know, you don't know what other, you know, how other people view you. You know, that, um, that other people are watching you and, um, you know, that there may be, you know, you may be in, I don't know, like sixth or seventh grade, but there may be a fourth grader who you were really nice to once and that stood out to them and they remembered that. So, um, take some time to think about, you know, um, am I making an impact on the people around me? Am I doing things that'll stick out that, you know, somebody would look at me and say like, that's a good, that's my role model. You know, I want to be like so-and-so I want, you know, I want to be kind like them. Like, um, I dropped my books in the hallway and they stopped to help me pick them up or <clears throat> they saw me being bullied and, they stopped and defended me, you know, whatever it may be. Think about, you know, um, am I taking on the qualities that I see in my role model and applying it to myself today and not necessarily putting it off for, you know, well, those are things that I hope to be when I'm older, when I'm an adult. Like, those are things you can do now as a kid. Um, so, yeah, just think about think about that. Um, and, yeah, that's all. That is all that I have for you guys. So, um, you guys have a good week, uh, stay safe, and I will see you again next week.